How to Purl Stitch for Left-Handed Knitters. Hi, I'm Kristen and welcome back to my channel, Studio Knit. If you're looking for the right-handed version of How to Purl Stitch, the link is in the description below. The Purl Stitch Step 1. You'll want to begin with the yarn in front of your needle this time. The knitting needle that has the stitches on it will be in your right hand and the needle in your left hand will be empty. With the yarn in the front of your work, insert the left knitting needle tip from back to front in that first stitch. Or you might wanna think of it as just straight into it. Your left knitting needle is now resting atop your right knitting needle in a crisscross position. Purl stitch step two. Beginning with your yarn in the front there, you will wrap it around the tip of your left needle in a clockwise direction. Finishing with your yarn in the front again. Purl stitch step three, slide the left needle tip down and bring the tip from front to back of the stitch, bringing the yarn with it. And purl stitch step four, slip the old stitch off the right needle. And now the new stitch is on your left needle. And if you're excited that you are learning how to purl, please like up this video. It really helps me out. Oh, and make sure to subscribe to Studio Knit as well. So let's purl our second stitch. Step one, the yarn is in the front. Insert your left needle tip into the stitch from left to right. This is also called purl wise when you insert your needle tip in this direction and your left needle will be resting atop the right hand needle. Step two, bring your working yarn around from the left to the back and right in a clockwise position, finishing with the yarn in the front. Step three, slide that left needle down and through, bringing the stitch with it. And step four is simply slipping that old stitch off of the right needle. And now we have two purl stitches on our left needle. Let's do this one more time together. Step one, making sure that that working yarn is in the front of your needle. That is very important every time you're purling and you're bringing the left knitting needle tip into that stitch on the right hand side. Step two is wrapping the working yarn clockwise around the left needle, finishing with it in the front. Step three, slide that left needle down and under, bringing the yarn along with it. And step four is sliding that old stitch off of the right needle. And now we have three purl stitches on the left. Just continue purling all the way down the row. When your first row is the knit stitch and your second row is the purl stitch, you are creating the stockinette knit stitch pattern. This is another easy two row repeat. It is in my knit stitch pattern book and I'll have a link in the description below. And here in my knitted swatch, the first few rows on the bottom are the garter stitch when you're knitting every single row. And atop it is that smooth stockinette stitch pattern. And that is accomplished again with just knitting the first row and purling the second row and repeating that pattern until your piece is the length you desire. The next step is going to be binding off, casting off those stitches. I have a great video for you linked in the description below and I will see you there. I hope you are inspired to give the purl stitch a try. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you here next time. Bye.